Good morning, ladies. I trust you. Thank you, Gladys. Ladies, please allow me to explain. Mrs. B's bottom's presence is not punishment. In fact, I only have your best interests in mind. Our best interests there. Ah, ta ta ta. Independence can be alluring, but you need to focus on your missions. Which brings us to the business at hand. Highly irregular meteor activity over the last 72 hours. Shooting stars? Can you say big deal? Actually, Clover, a great many of these have struck the Earth, including, most recently, a major observatory. Since most meteors are smaller than a pebble and burn up in the atmosphere, I'm guessing these would have to be huge. Precisely. Whoop is inclined to believe that there is something sinister at hand. I guess I'm in. Anything's better than playtime with Nanny yells a lot. Very well, then. Gladys? Dispensing gadgets. Magno Go-Go boots will allow you to walk on metallic surfaces. Ice Queen perfume will freeze any object on contact. And one other item. Oh, you're giving us a car? This so makes up for the nanny thing, Jared. Oh, the remote will provide you with a direct link to Mrs. B's bottom. It's impervious to interference, and the blinking red light indicates a message is waiting. Oh, great. Reach out and annoy someone. Oh. Well, I expect you to behave on this mission. Remember, you're representing Whoop, the World Organization of Human Protection. I think we get the gist. Another meteor. Let's get you to your ship. Good afternoon, girls. <gasps> Jerry, we can't take another mission right now. We have a midterm to study for. I'm sorry, girls. But college students have been disappearing in the Canadian Northwest. Studying can wait. We've got student hotspots to check out. Compiling a list of hotspots in a three-mile radius of the college? Yes, Gladys. I was about to request that you compile a... The the list complete. Hmm. Burger Buddies, Chili Vanilli Frozen Yogurt, Das Coffee House? Bingo! That's the one. Das Coffee House? Well, how can you be sure? Please, anyone crazy enough to compete with Mega Coffee Mart is up to something. So what gadgets do we have for this mission, Jer? You'll be issued your head for cover <gasps> hoverboards, ultra-sensitive earring microphone communicators, <gasps> mini charm bracelets, hmm. and our newest invention, hot off the design table, the second skin. Hot is right. I want one of those for the prom. It repels, resists, and releases any exterior substance. Uh <laughs> How impressive. No one has ever cracked Whoop security before. Well, what is that? A club for weirdos? It's the World Organization of Human Protection. We help the world. Secretly, of course. So, you're like spy? Precisely. Uh, back off, Baldy! I got manicured nails and I know how to use them. Tenacious. You should see me after a pedicure. <laughs> and a quick wit to boot. How would you like to join our team? <laughs> She's the perfect candidate. I've been searching for another spy for weeks now. And imagine how easy the training will be since you girls already know each other. You mean I get prestige, world travel, a cute little phone, and I get to torture these losers? Mm -hmm. Ah, sign me up. <laughs> what? Oh, happy now? My diary's soaked. <clears throat> Sorry to interrupt the ladies' wrestling, but we've got more pressing concerns. There's been a disappearance of several men of note from around the world. The first is... That super cute supermodel tie! Right. Our next missing male is... Kenner Knightley, a totally VIP VJ! If you say so. And finally, there's... Well, why don't you just tell me who he is? <gasps> J.R.L. Jr., the dashing junior senator from Massachusetts. Who knew you were so political? Now, what these captors all have in common is... I know, I know! They're TFTL! Totally famous, totally luscious! Ah! <laughs> Oops, brain cramp! Just remembered we're in the middle of a hate fest! Anything else to go on before we, we go on? Just this. I can't make out who Ty's captors are, so what do we do with this 411, Jer? Warning, a vehicle of unknown origin has been spotted en route to Kangaroo Point, Australia. Make that a 
at 911. Kangaroo Point, Australia? Skate legend Tony Eagle shooting his latest flick there. Oh, I bet the kidnappers are riding their mystery vehicle to take him. If that's the case, then I'd better have Gladys give you the equipment to hunt down this unknown nemesis ASAP. Question I, Zero Gravity Boots. Sonic Disintegrator Boombox. And for the fashion conscious spy in need of withstanding a force of 100,000 megatons, the brute is suit. Better let Clover have that one out. You're right. I wouldn't want to stink it up like my Pilates clothes. You guys know me so well. It's as if you read my diary. Hmm. Well, at least we didn't miss the toilet. So nice to see you, girls. Cool tank. It's filled with specimens from the Indian Ocean. And nasty fish gunk. Not for long. Oh, Gladys. Hey, Jer, does she clean bathrooms? And gutters? I don't do gutters. Neither does Alex. I see that living together has done wonders for your friendship. Huh? Okay, get this. We were cleaning the house because Miss Slave Driver here is totally against fun. And then? And then this crazed mailman smashed a hole through our wall. And then he threw a fridge at us. But the weirdest thing is he just disappeared without a trace. Oh, hey. Maybe he did leave a trace. You sure that's not mildew? Quite sure. It's an unknown metal-based substance that has been traced to three locations. You girls will look for clues at its source. Please be somewhere fabulous. The first is a sulfur mine in northern Uzbekistan. P.U. The second is a sewage treatment facility in New Brunswick. Ah. We'll take number three. A wise choice. You girls are off to an abandoned wig factory. On this mission, you will have the following gadgets. The Wind Tunnel 9000 hairdryer, the Biolab watch, and our newest device, the Quick Slick. Gladys, if you would. I apologize in advance. Why did she apologize? Because the Quick Slick is equipped with a supply of extra slippery crude oil. Press here. 